Yo, two British nerds back again on the streets of London. Shout out to uh, JD Sports over here. <laughs> Yo, hold up, guys, one sec. Give you guys some music for a second. So I think this, I love this song, it's amazing. Listen, listen. We're back. Uh, sorry, I had to do that, man. I thought those guys were totally sick in their creativity. I have to share it with you guys. So, um, let's go ahead with this week's, or today's miniature little uh, podcast. Today's Tuesday, which means tomorrow's Wednesday, which means new comic books are out. For all you Batman fans, check out All Star Batman that comes out tomorrow. Written by um, Scott Schneider and illustrated by one, by one of my favorite artists, being uh, Ramita Jr. <laughs> so grab your copy, grab your copy, guys and girls. It's going to be a big, big release tomorrow, you know. So uh, I actually wanted to do this podcast just because of uh, the Luke Cage trailer that dropped today. Um, but before we get started, I just wanted to say that DC have announced, DC Warner Brothers have announced that. Um, Man is still two will be will be made so it's it's on post production or in production so uh, DC fans we will be getting another Superman movie um, I hope the Superman movie is much better than the last one because the last one was very very poor Batman Batman vs Superman and Man is still one wasn't great at all um, so yeah uh, what else do we have um, yeah. So, Luke Cage trailer dropped today, um, I thought it was cool, humour is very intense, it seems like it's very very light hearted but it's not because we've been told it's going to be a very very dark tone um, TV show when it comes out. Um, I like the fact that it portrayed a bit more storyline and action which means I guess we're going to get, we're going to see a lot more storyline than action but maybe I'm wrong but that's the kind of energy I got from literally from watching um, this um, this trailer guys I love the uh, the brute the brute the brute brutality the brute the bruteness the strength of Luke Cage walking through beating up people throwing people around um, <laughs> catching bullets with his bare skin and um, it was pretty cool it actually seemed like it seemed like it seemed like it, it has um, it will have a lot of comedy um, uh, literally a lot of comedy in it and I'm feeling that because I, um, you know, I don't think we've seen a lot of, we haven't seen any of the Marvel, I guess Netflix shows that have that much comedy. Um, but I'm really looking forward to it, man. Again, if you guys want to get into Luke Cage, you know, his origin stories, pick up Luke Cage Masterworks Volume 1, um, sorry, Luke Cage um, Heroes for Hi Hero Heroes for Hire, um, which is part of, you know, Marvel's Masterwork range. So. Um, get volume one, so I'm gonna say it again. Let me see. Masterworks volume one, Luke Cage, Heroes for Hire. Uh, but yeah, man, like it was pretty, pretty cool, man. I liked it. I, li I just, I just loved the trailer. I think it was dope. Sweet Christmas, you get me, um, man. I love the fight scenes. I love the tone of it as well. It was like, like I said before, it was very, very light, but it. It looked, you know, you could see the dark substance and elements literally behind, um, behind, behind the show. Sorry, behind, uh, behind the shit. What am I getting tongue twisters for? You can see the sorry, the intensity and the dark substance behind the humor in it. So I'm really looking forward to seeing it. I'm really happy. Um, well, <laughs> I'm really happy. Sorry, it's PC one. Sorry, I'm really happy that. Um, what I'm looking for that Claire the nurse who made her first appearance in Daredevil and Jessica and 
uh, a second appearance in um, Jessica Jones is literally in this season. So overall guys, I was happy with the trailer. Again, to sum it up, I felt humor, intensity, light heart, lightness, and just straight up um, action. So I'm really, really looking forward to seeing how they portray Luke Cage's character. And what I like about Luke Cage is he's a very, 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 very humble, calm dude. But he's, he's very powerful at the same time. And that literally reminds me of um, the man himself, <laughs> otherwise known as the Silver Surfer. And also like Doctor Strange. Very power, very humble, but very, very powerful at the same time. Um, like I said, um, actually, yeah, actually, so I'm getting tongue twisted, I'm thinking too much. Um, overall, it was a dope trailer, um, very fun. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this. And my Netflix subscription, sub, sorry, <laughs> subscription will be renewed, uh, renewed once the show comes out. Because I only, I only subscribe to Netflix literally when the shows, when the Marvel shows are out. So um, yeah, looking forward to it. Marvel, Netflix, Luke Cage this year. I'm also looking forward to Iron Fist. And they did say that there will be no Daredevil until 2018 or 2017. It's going to be pretty, uh, pretty interesting. Yay! So uh, looks like looks like looks like we're getting some road rage out here. Yo, um, so yeah, man, I loved it. Luke Cage, indestructible skin, and I, I love the fact that again Marvel taking chances of these characters being Luke Cage, Jessica Jones, Daredevil, Iron Fist, the Defenders, and even Marvel's Agents of Shield. So it's not a, it's also nice to see you know a black a black superhero and a black cast. You know, which we, we rarely, rarely ever get. And I'm also looking forward to the Black Panther when that comes out, the movie, because 90% of the, of the cast members have been officially confirmed to be black, which totally makes sense. I'm really love to see how Stanley's cameo fits into all of this, you know. Um, but yeah, man, overall, right, you know, regardless if you're a DC fan, Marvel fan, it's a good time to be alive. It's a good time, well, you should be grateful that you're alive anyway. But it's an amazing time to be a, a comic book nerd, a geek. Because we're getting all these dope movies, regardless if they flop or not. You know, we're getting Avengers, Justice League, Guardians of the Galaxy, um, Spider-Man, Black Panther. You know, pretty cold, pretty dope, pretty, pretty, uh, pretty dope time to be literally alive, man. So, with that being said, I'll catch you guys real soon. And let me know your comments about uh, the Luke Cage trailer. And again. If you guys have anything that you want to ask me, or there's, if there's anything I can do for you guys, please let me know. And um, yeah, that's basically it. Two British nerds signing out. Peace out, guys. Have a good morning, day, evening, whatever time zone you're at.